Hey guys, yeah, we are in the building where those astronauts, all the NASA astronauts, do their training. And behind us, that is a replica of the Orion capsule that will take them all the way to the moon further than any astronauts, any humans have ever traveled away from Earth. 1972, we mentioned it, more than 51 years ago. That was the last time humans went to the moon so long ago that I believe the only person on this newscast who was even alive to see it was Pete Delkis. That's how long it has been. But now a new generation will be able to see astronauts go to the moon. NASA is sending them back late next year on this capsule. And this morning they told us who those astronauts are going to be. Looking at the video we've got from right to left, we have NASA's Christina Koch, Reed Weissman, who's the commander, and Victor Glover, plus Canadian astronaut Jeremy Hansen. Those are the four who will be going to the moon, as we said, late next year. This is historic for many reasons, but possibly one of the more important reasons. It's the first time a woman and a person of color will go to the moon, that being Koch and Victor Glover. It's also a big deal because it's the start of what NASA hopes will be a permanent presence on the moon. Now we sat down one on one with the crew commander and some NASA officials who said yes, today is a big deal. But their hope is that in the future, this mission is nothing more than just a footnote in the history of something much bigger. I really want this to be a small step. I want I want us to look back and go, Oh, that was Artemis II. That's, that's the first mission that got us to Mars. I expect that we are going to be a multi-planet species one day, and this is the start of that. And again, this mission, Artemis II, is scheduled to launch no earlier than November of 2024. After that, they will send another crew, hopefully in 2025, to actually land and walk on the moon, and then, as they said, Mars and beyond. For now, from NASA's Johnson Space Center in Houston. I'm Sean Giggy.